here in the studio styling up some thrifted clothes. This purple dress is a piece that I've had for quite some time. I thrifted it, I would say, probably 10 years ago. I wasn't quite sure how to wear it. I didn't like the part here that was kind of solid. I just didn't find it flattering. It kind of went in this kind of tube shape and then there's this line when this isn't cinched up. There's this kind of line that comes across and I didn't like the way that looked. But I love the puff sleeves. I love the fact that it's mohair and it's this knitted lace pattern. I just loved it. I really like the, uh, the way it looks when I just cinch it up a little bit here. It just kind of breaks up that line. It makes it kind of more interesting to me, that asymmetry. Yeah, I like that too. Do you? Good. And I love the color. And then this shirt that I, it was kind of this off-white color, which was, it was nice, but I did already have one that color. And I was really looking for this color to wear under this. It's kind of this purplish blue. And I really love the way it turned out. And then I had a different jean vest on with this, but it was shorter and it was still showing quite a bit of this solid kind of, you know, fabric here. And I really liked the way this looked, this chunky vest with it, and it still shows the puff sleeves. So yeah. I really like the, the combination. That's awesome. And then this little fringe purse, I love the gray with it. And these beads, this kind of, and I put on a little bracelet because I think I would, I'm starting to wear more bracelets now that it's getting warmer out. It's pretty. It's a little sparkle. I like your rings too. Thank you. Kind of this sparkly gray. Oh, like, oh, almost like little snowflakes. They are, yeah. yeah. They remind me of that a little bit. Yeah, so this is the completed look. And then I just kind of put these casual Western boots on with it just to kind of I don't know, I guess it ties the vest in for me. It gives it that little bit of Western, kind of casual. That's fun. Yeah, and I would grab a little basket and go to a festival. I think every outfit today, I'm going to say, I'm going to a festival. <laughs> 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 I think I want to go to a festival. this I do Just too. love 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 this nice and warm oh yeah Dave it looks great this is just one of those rare finds it was $15 thrifted it last week and couldn't believe it but, um, I love what you've done how you put this together well thank you well I love blues and browns together and and it's kind of a three-quarter sleeve, but... Yeah, yeah. You've kind of... Just extended it with some silk, yeah, and it's yes. silk sleeve, and uh, and I like the boots, so that actually you suggested with this outfit. But it's, uh, it's just so much fun. It's fun to wear this. of a summery nautical look and I was kind of looking for something to wear with this blazer that I just thrifted. I had found this I think last year. It was in the dollar rack. <laughs> we have a dollar rack at our local store. I knew I loved the, the pattern. I wasn't sure how I was going to style it and then Dave came home with this. He went to the thrift store when he was out running errands and this was on the dollar rack. So I just kind of put it all together and I really, I think it's kind of a cute look. A nice little summer look. I feel like I'm going to go for a picnic. Yeah, that's a wonderful look. <laughs> I like it, yeah. It's kind of fun and I actually really like this skirt. Um, it's got a little belt on it. It's got this cute little belt that came with it. It's a little clasp. Yeah. And this shirt is really 
really cool. I've had this, but this was my grandmother's actually, this little scarf. And I just kind of put it on my neck. There's quite an open, um, it's kind of this open area here. There's no button. So I thought, ah, oh, it's just kind of nice to add a little scarf. And then, then if you get hot, hot, you can take it off. And then this little basket bag. This is probably a little bit why I feel like I'm going on a picnic. It looks like a little picnic basket, doesn't it? Yeah, sure, yeah. <laughs> It's amazing how all of this is thrifted. Well, I know, and that's just it. Like, I don't know if I would have actually got this skirt if it wasn't a dollar, to be quite honest with you. It's not really always my style, but now that I got it, I have it, uh, and I've styled it up, I absolutely love this, and I will definitely wear this this summer. It's awesome. <laughs> It's amazing how you can just keep what you're wearing, take off the fur coat, put on a sweater. And I just love this combination with, with the, the silk shirt. Keep the pants and just switch up the, the boots. And it's a completely different look. This is really nice, Dave. You know what? You really surprised me with this one. Yeah. I mean, I just can't get over how great this looks on you. This vintage women's sweater. How about I show you this? Bugatti. As a crossbody I liked it too. Yeah, yeah, I like this look. And uh, just a kind of informal way, but yet you feel like you're really styled up. Awesome. I look. love this, love this. dress yeah. you know what when I first put this on I was like is this gonna be really uncomfortable because the material feels you know that kind of metallic feel to it it kind of reminds me of my grandparents couch in the 60s and but I just love the look of it uh, but then I just kind of I have you know this shirt underneath it this little sparkly piece I love this layering piece I've gotten a lot of use out of it and then Dave's leggings that he made and I really like the look of it. And I could actually, if I wanted to show off the top of these leggings, I could kind of cinch this up a little or ruche it up and put a little kilt pin. And that'd be kind of cool too, if you wanted to make it a little shorter. I just love it. And then the little ballet flats with it. I thought it kind of looked cute. I mean, uh, the silver and, I don't know, kind of went together and it's different. Different and fun, and very comfortable, actually. Which means I'll probably wear it. <laughs> that's awesome. Ah, oh, that's a great outfit. That's a great look, Heather. Thanks, Dave. Dave. <sighs> Here's a simple way to take a tux jacket and mix it up with a couple layers of shorts. Yeah, you have two. Yeah. And it's nice because if it's a little bit cooler out, I'm still pretty warm. What made you think to put the shirt with the with the shorts? I love the idea of well, I love the blues and the browns together. Okay. Um, that combination, the black just breaks it up a little bit. But I love the idea of taking elegance and mixing it with everyday wear. So that you can start dressing up more on a regular basis, right? I don't see too many people doing this. and It's a lot of fun. Yeah, and I would never think to put a pair of shorts over another pair of shorts either. 
It actually looks like it has a cuff. Yeah. Let's yeah. See, let well, layering is, it's amazing what you can do with layering. And uh, even putting these on here. Yeah, these leg warmers. I just put in, I have to get multiple colors. I want to dye a bunch of leg warmers because I find they're such a useful thing whether I'm using them on my arms. Yeah. This is the Diane von Furstenberg dress that I recently thrifted, and I just, I, I love everything about it. I did have it with heels, and I kind of liked how it had a little more drama when it was closer to the ground. Something about it, I love the way the, the slits, even in the back as well. It's just kind of, it's a lot of fun to wear. You feel elegant in this dress. The silk just feels so nice. And I just decided to pair it with this gold brooch and a little bit of gold jewelry and these kind of seafoam green earrings. And this little gold bag. I think I would I could wear this out casual or dressy. Really. I love the that black line that runs on the dress. Those two black lines that really Asymmetrical yeah, kind of, yeah, I just really like that and the pa the print on it. It's gorgeous. It's I know. Gorgeous. Well, that's what really drew me to it. In the, and I love the little details, like this little slit in the wrist, you know, in the, the wrist in the sleeve, I guess. Yeah. And all these slits at the bottom, and then these little slippers. Yeah, they're adorable. They're so comfortable. And I just love the look of them. They're so good. Little April Cornell slide-ons. But they're elegant, but yet they're still casual. You know? You get a little bit of both. It could go either way. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun, Heather. It is. I just love I love this dress. Really love it. Yeah, so here's another way to wear the leg warmers. Yeah, it just kind of shows you how if you have the right stretch to it and the right colors, how if you had different, 10 different colors and different, uh, even the texture to it, so that, you know, whatever type of wool or, you know, uh, if you had alpaca, you could really use these fibers to style up a lot of pieces, uh, wearing them in different manners like this. But uh, I just love this, the, the shorts over the leather pants. It's kind of a subtle look. Damn, uh, this is a really great look. And then the it's embroidered great. detail on the, on the vest. That's a family vest. Yeah. I love family pieces. Mm -hmm. Especially when you're packing to go for a trip. Yeah. <laughs> but it's nice to kind of add a little bit of uh, feminine nature into your prints to be able to mix with something that's a little more rustic. You know? Really nice. Yeah. Love, I love this.